Republicans from around Colorado are in Pueblo this weekend. The party is holding its central committee meeting at the convention center. As News 5's Andy Cohen reports, the big decision on the table is whether to opt out of the primary election next year. Republicans from around Colorado are in Pueblo tonight, preparing to decide who should get to pick the candidates their party will support in next year's midterms. The actual vote for tomorrow is very simple. It's whether we opt out of having primaries period and make sure everything gets taken care of through the caucus and the assemblies. And again, if I hope everyone knows what a caucus and an assembly is, because what we're finding is not many people do, um, rather than going from a caucus assembly to a primary and then to a general election. When Propositions 107 and 108 passed in 2016, they gave unaffiliated voters in our state a chance to participate in party primaries for the first time. Those who favor opting out suspect that heavy spending by outside political groups influenced the GOP primary last year, leading to losses. Those who oppose the move anticipate that unaffiliated voters will sour on GOP candidates in the general election, and that even Republican voters who are unfamiliar with the caucus will feel left out. The Republican Party being the Big Ten Party as it is, there's always going to be a debate on every issue that comes up. And it's not just this meeting that's drawing Republicans to the Steel City. I think we've visited about 15, 20 counties so far, the Eastern Slope, the Front Range, and we're headed over to the Western Slope tomorrow night. Heidi Ganahl, the first Republican challenger hoping to unseat Governor Jared Polis, also made a campaign stop here today. The old Colorado way of life of just you be you and do your thing has kind of gone by the wayside. And I think people are really uncomfortable with it and looking for new leadership. Watching out for you, Pueblo, Andy Cohen, News 5.